Okay, let's finish uh, going through. Hey, is that Carmen's mom's? Mrs. Oh, can't my goodness, get by this shit here. Hmm. Hold on a minute. I know what this calls for. Nagasaki! What'd you eat? I don't know how to f do not go that way then. Ah! Oh, I think I know what I need to do. I think I know what I've got to do here. Yeah. Do that. Go there. Turn it on. Yeah. <sighs> I didn't join the company for this. We've got our orders. Yeah, but how come we always get the shit jobs? Go clean out the barracks. Go round up civilians in their homes. Go up a gay man's butthole and guard against intruders. Fucking sucks. Armed guards? What are they doing here? Whoever seeks to blow up the city clearly doesn't want anyone stopping them. You must get past them, new kid. Go fuck them up. Okay. Is there any way of me... Well, let's first swap party, remember? Because I love Buzz. He's my Negro. And... Medic! I'm hit! Take cover! Taking fire! <laughs> Wait, please say I got the initial tap there, because I did swing. I want this by the book. Oh, but I grossed them all out before they, they start, so up here. Taking fire. That guy's so going down. Uh, you can't even heal and touch yourself, can you? But what you can do is smash this fucking piece of shit. He did no damage. And you got head tried. Um let's just take this guy out. Tell my wife I wasn't that into her. Right. The question is Well, it's not even a question, I'll just heal myself. Instead of wasting another revive. And I can just basic tack this guy down. And we're not wasting anything major. We have loads of health stuff. Let's just go through. Can't believe they sent government officials to defend a snook inside a guy's arsehole. Snook it came to the storm at dark. Neath the cold depths of the London heart. Hello, new kid. I am Katata Fish. Katata Fish of the Stomach's Core. The trigger of the thermonuclear device lies before you. I have tried to solve its riddle, but I have been unable to disarm it. Katata Fish riddle will soon be told. There are only moments to spare. Find a way to disengage the trigger, or all will be lost. Okay. I need to disarm the nuke. And it doesn't even look like I do it. And I think I know who we need to get. We obviously need to get fucking Jimmy. With the disabled sign. Obviously. This calls for a little bardic exit. Of course it did. Snook abortion sequence initiated. Look at when the syringe is over the middle of the office. Every critter holds it dear. Every Ow. Jesus. The... Big or small. Ow. Jesus. Okay, I'm not doing well there. Danger. Critical arterial rupture. But he like swings it over it, you left click, and then it doesn't do it. It just goes to the side. Alright, we'll skip that. 
and uh, continue. That's just like a joke way of ending the game, but you never know. Right. Right, let's just reload this again. Ah. Oh. Is it bugging out? Am I doing something wrong? Alright, we'll try this time. Let's try this time. This is just infuriating. Look, where is the command, my lord? This calls for a little bardic. Do that. Let me in. Snook abortion sequence initiated. Begin electrolytic infusion. Ah. This part is easy. Every cold, so cold. The dial A. Abortion access slit stress. Abortion access slit dial A. This is the part where it bugs. Okay. I need it back. Oh, so you have to swap between left and right clicking. Well, it could say hold right click down, but it doesn't. What a piece of shit. What a piece of fucking shit. Well, we're through that part, so. It's all that matters. It's all that matters now. But we've avoided a schnook. Disaster. <laughs> what is it, Mr. Slate? What are you feeling? <laughs> Jesus! <laughs> Jesus Christ! <laughs> Great job, new kid. But your journey is not yet complete. Yes, but should we ever need your services again, we will call. <laughs> Great job. You've disarmed the snook. South Park is saved. Yes. Now let's finish this, new kid. Let's beat Clyde once and for all and take back the stick of truth. I thought I went bald for a second then. If you ever want to go back in, just down. Yeah, no, it's not gonna happen. I got you perk. Uh if we additional damage to take less damage from enemies suffering from bleeding, that'll do me. Let's go fucking beat the shower Clyde. I don't want Jimmy though. Trusted buzz. Fool! You thought you could conquer the Fortress of Darkness! Clyde, back away from that stuff! Oh, but I have yet to complete my army! You have come to witness the power of darkness! Stop! Clyde! You have no idea what that stuff is! Yeah, it's green sauce from Taco Bell. I took it from their construction site. Dude, that's not Taco Bell sauce. Then why'd I find it at the Taco Bell? It leaked out of a UFO, Clyde. It's toxic goo from another galaxy. Think about it. Since when does Taco Bell have a green sauce, dude? Actually, since about a year ago. What? Taco Bell has green sauce now. No way. They've had it longer than a year. I've always gotten spicy green burritos. Yeah, no, I'm saying in the packets. They just started putting green sauce in packets. The fuck? How the fuck did I miss it? Ha ha! I don't seem so foolish now, do I? That doesn't mean you have Taco Bell green sauce, dip fuck. Yeah, Clyde, why do you think that shit's glowing? Maybe because of the three varieties of chili peppers. Just give us the stick, asshole. Or what? You'll beat me up? Haha! <laughs> I've got another surprise for you. Oh, fuck off! I'm gonna make love to you, woman! <laughs> <laughs> ah! <laughs> hey, hey, Not the zombie chef! Nazi's <laughs> OP chef! <laughs> what the fuck? This all makes sweet love. Hell. Oh, chocolate salty balls attack. <laughs> this is great. Let's fucking just stack some air. He's immune to bleeds. Heal and touch me up, and I get PP for that as well. Cause I'm just like an absolute boss. Uh, we'll profess a chaos. A 
Okay, I heal. But it's a life drain. One fast five hundred. Uh, not great. Holy shit, does damage. Might have to swap butters out here. For, uh. To try calming out. I gotta get out of here. Butters isn't gonna do enough damage, I don't think. You wanna throw down, dog? I'll throw down. No, no. Gonna make love to your woman. Ah, there's a lot of damage. Kama might be the key here for this fight. Let me see my swear at the curse attack. Yeah, Carmen. Alright, let's do. The shadowy network of assassins. Let's do this. That was alright, that's pretty cool looking, but wasn't great. Let's throw a magic missile him again. No, no. And we can throw him a curse at him, which does damage, so. That does damage. Hello, children. Get him off me. I'm sorry, boys. Oh, shit, he's back again. This is like such a weird fight. It's just so much in this fight. This fucking chef. For a tampon armor. Even I wasn't having a tampon, is it? Right, I need to give some PP to us both. Mainly Karma, because he can do damage. Uh, straight up attack. Hey, I raised you from the dead. You have to obey. Obey me. In <laughs> oh. What? He was slowly get bringing his conscious back. I only cursed the shit out of him. She's like the best ability so far in the game. The damage that does is ridiculous. Okay. That suddenly just didn't allow me to attack him. China. I can't attack him. I failed that one. And that one. How? Nazi right, how is this gonna work? Uh, I think health's more important at the moment. And he can't do it with that. Who wants them? For some reason, Cartman can attack and I can't. Oh, no, I can attack. Maybe when he's like in that angry state, I can't do out. Oh, shit. That's not good. Uh, 
Oh, now you don't? Remember who you serve. No. Uh, this calls for power portion. And this calls for a magic attack of curse. This should end it. Cool, Carmen. Almost. Yeah, I can't attack him when he's like that. Get off me, you piece of fucking Nazi chef. Almost there. Children, what have I done? <laughs> Black can't even control his own Nazi zombies. Oh, can't we could actually finish him off? Okay, if he, if that actually did damage. Children, everybody, I'm back. Enough of this. Okay, you just set chef on fire. Your eons of torment are at an end, ruler of darkness. Uh, okay, um, you know what? I'm not playing anymore. You have broken the rules of the stick, and for that, I banish thee. I banish thee from space and time. <laughs> uh... We did it, dude. That was awesome. You did it. Your noble quest is at an end. And for all your deeds and all your time put into this, I hereby promote you to King Douchebag. Congratulations. Quickly, now let's get the stick back to safety before anyone can do. We've got him. We've got the Dragonborn. Dragonborn? What the? Who, what? So it really is the Dragonborn. Just can't stop being a thorn in our side, huh? He has to stick a truth. How does this guy know you, King Douchebag? King Douchebag? Is that what you told him your name was? Why didn't you tell them your real name, Dovakin? You don't remember, do you? How we tried to find you? Look, that stick belongs with the Fighters of Zaron. Give it back. Fighters of Zaron? Boys, what's going on here is much more complex than that. This isn't the first time a UFO has crashed to Earth. You see, in 1947, a UFO crashed in Roswell, New Mexico. Oh, God. Oh, brother, spare us. Hang on a sec. A UFO crashed in Roswell, and a new government agency was created to investigate the paranormal. Our agency. Can we skip this? Like, hit the skip button or something? Oh, you don't want to skip this. Yes, we do. Whenever aliens are spotted, vampires run amok, our agency is there, and we have never lost a fight. That is... Until four years ago, when we investigated a child. Yawn, yawn, yawn. A child who had an unnatural power inside him. I had orders from the president to secure the child so that we could harness his powers before our enemies could. But he slipped through our hands. The government wants the new kid for his farts? That's dumb. His farts? No. His amazing ability to make friends so quickly on any social network. Before he was five years old, he had 3.2 billion friends on Facebook alone. Do you have any idea the power that kind of gift yields in today's world? It's time to come with us, Dovahkiin. Time to stop resisting and use your gift for your country. Is he really still talking? Are we so different, you and I, Dovahkiin? Uh... You have to do what the government tells you to do, just like me. We're all just pawns in their game. I'll admit you are fascinating. You have more power than any child I've ever come across, and yet all you seem to really care about is this. It must be very important. What does it do? Whoever controls the stick controls the universe, dumbass. Yeah, stupid. Controls the... But then... I wouldn't have to do what I was told anymore. I could... <laughs> I control the universe! Get back! Back, I say, all of you! I can do anything! Anything I want! <laughs> I no longer need you, new kid! I control the universe! Ah! 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 
damn thing! How does it work? Show me how it works! Yeah, right. Dovahkiin, why should we be on the opposite sides? Join me, Dovahkiin. Rule by my side. Rule. And you can have this all to yourself forever. I can offer you all! Just get me safely out of here! You can rule with this once again! You underestimated the character of the fighters of Zaron. What binds us is more than that relic. And you failed to recognize the character of our alliance. Yes, and that friendship is more important to any of us than even the stick of truth. Dude, where are you going? <laughs> Princess Kenny! <laughs> At least one of you has some sense. You'd sell us all out? But why, Princess Kenny? Because Princess Kinney was born a half-orc, whose entire village <laughs> was wiped out by humans and elves. Morgan Freeman? You see, when humans and elves lived together in the forest of Hollow Falls, an elven queen fell in love with the orc known as Dandar, the first one to possess the Stick of Truth. They loved in secret and had a child. A beautiful little girl, a girl who watched as everyone she loved was killed in cold blood. And that is why she waited and plotted all this time to take the stick from you. For Princess Guinea is true heir to the stick of truth. Wow, that's pretty cute. Just one thing, Morgan Freeman. How come every time something convoluted needs explaining, you show up? Because every time I show up and explain something, I earn a freckle. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Princess Kitty, come back here! <laughs> 